Hi, and welcome to the Mining Overview Series brought to you by Cisco Systems. I'm your host, Roland Plett, and I invite you to dig deeper into what Cisco has for mining at cisco.com slash go slash mining. Enjoy. The cyclical boom and bust of mining is a familiar rhythm to industry veterans. Leveraging the opportunities that come from this cycle requires mines to be adaptable and demands a clear view of operational realities. The digital strategies available today provide a viable solution to these requirements. They offer a clear and current view of operational realities with increased agility to make timely adjustments. As digital capabilities grow, the ability to pivot business strategies also grows. A lot of the focus today is on moving industrial vehicles autonomously or by teleremote operation. For example, we've seen large investments flow into autonomous haulage systems, autonomous drilling systems, and teleremote dozers, shovels, and loaders. Another important focus area is to make mine assets more visible to dashboards and analytics platforms. This increased visibility makes it possible to strengthen the security of assets, improve predictive maintenance algorithms, identify new business trends, and streamline the effort of mobile workers. Although these strategies are not yet pervasive, their adoption excel is accelerated by COVID-19, and we expect market pressure to accelerate them even faster. Early adopters are now exploring ways to extend their teleremote and autonomous operation to more parts of the mine. To move in this direction, strategy, strategies become more dependent on various video technologies and autonomous machines like robots and drones. These technologies are mature enough to show promise, but the processes and infrastructure needed to normalize their use are in the very early stages of adoption. Let's take a look at some of the business value that comes from these digital strategies. The mining industry steadily increases its adoption of digital strategies. As adoption grows, there are a few use cases that are gaining considerable momentum and are worth reviewing in more detail. The first one we'll look at is autonomous vehicle movement. Large mining companies typically have some autonomous and teleremote vehicles in their fleet today. Personnel and maintenance savings justify this transition to autonomous haulage and teleremote dozers, shovels, and loaders. In smaller mines, however, the transition to autonomy is not quite feasible yet. Overall, these technologies and their benefits are well understood in the industry and over time, their adoption will expand to a much larger portion of the mining industry. The second use case is asset visibility. Each of the top industrial sensor companies has thousands of sensors on the market. It's hard to imagine a measurement point that doesn't have a corresponding sensor. With Cisco's ability to move data from these sensors to anywhere securely, it's been easier than ever to gain visibility to current asset conditions. Gaining this visibility opens opportunities to optimize production with more precise information or reduce maintenance costs by predicting failure trends and identify security risks before an incident occurs. The third use is secure mobile worker. Field personnel are both sources of data for safety monitoring and also benefactors of data through digital instrumentation. First, a mobile worker's condition and environment is central to any safety program. Clip-on sensors are now available for health monitoring, gas detection, and even noise profiles. And these can be important metrics in your safety program. Second, equipping mobile workers with access to online processes, reporting, and operating procedures provides the business with more accurate and current data for decision-making and reporting. The last use case has to do with remote operations and is a bit more forward-looking. Once a digital strategy becomes pervasive, the increased visibility and control allows tasks to be automated or moved to remote operation centers. Physical tasks and visual work that needs to be done on site can be delegated to industrial robots or drones. The need for on-site personnel becomes an exception. When this level of digitization is achieved, safety incidents can truly reach that coveted zero and the agility of digital operations becomes real. Let's take a look at how these digital solutions work. All this new visibility is made possible by getting data from hard to reach locations in the field and making them available to critical decision makers anywhere. 
All digital systems quantify information at the source and then communicate that information to decision makers or systems for analysis. The following steps from the source all the way through to the data consumer describe the system in more detail. Let's start at the source. Thousands of industrial grade sensors are available to digitize anything your operation finds valuable. These sensors can detect vibration, temperature, flow, and many other measurements without disrupting operations and without disrupting existing control systems. The second step is standardizing and securing the data. The data format coming from sensors varies greatly and requires standardization. Doing this standardization on a network device close to the source allows for efficient streaming of data to all the authorized data requests. The third aspect is moving the data. With the availability of multiple mature wireless technologies and with the increasing communication capacity to very remote locations, the options for connectivity can be overwhelming. This is where Cisco and its partner community delivers significant value to guide you into the best suited communication technologies available today. The last part, and possibly the most fun, is leveraging the data for business value. There are so many ways to leverage these new data streams. Operators may have a dashboard of KPIs and a big data analytics engine accessing the same data stream. Each of these upstream applications have their own data format requirements and data frequency needs. Designing effective dashboards and leveraging data for big data analytics can be complex, but there are numerous qualified industry partners available to help. In summary, dramatic cycles in the mining industry compel operators to become more efficient and agile. This is achieved through digital strategies. Today's digital strategies increase visibility to current operational realities, and tomorrow's strategies will enable greater automation and control so that sites will become even more productive and safer and responsive to future challenges. Find out more about how Cisco helps mining operators with their digital strategies at cisco.com go mining.